Yes, hi, uh, this is Dr. Shahar Khan. I just did uh, my third explant uh, for the day. I had uh, a lady that had uh, augmentation done in 2009, a second set. Uh, and as you can see right here, look at the height of this implant on the right and then the height on the left. She had a grade four capsule or contracture. And you can see this is more ball shaped than this. And overall, you can also appreciate there is an indentation, a contracture that is about to form. And um, I removed all pathologic tissue right here. And as you can see, uh, this is a complete end block. Uh, there was no disturbance um, of this capsule and it was removed as all one piece. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna go ahead and cut so that I can see what the internal contents are. And for the first time, we're gonna get exposure uh, to the inside. And you can see I've entered now very carefully. And as you can see, look at the inside for the first time. You can see how it has folded up on itself. There is a contracture on this side too. And we will see as I open up, again, being very careful as I lift up, look at the way the implant was situated, like all tight. And now it's going to open up. You can see the wrinkle right in the center. And this is again consistent with the contracture on this side. Um, and so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up and then I'm going to remove the silicone implant. And then as you will see, some fluid inside it, the capsule, some areas that are thick. She had a double capsule, two. Uh, implants uh, and you can see some areas that are thick some areas that are thin and some that are almost transparent You can see my blue glove underneath. I'm going to go ahead and uh, so this implant is indeed intact You can actually still make out the line in the middle. This is abnormal This is like the equator and if this is the earth right in the center and this is how it was bunched up Compressed so let's go ahead and see this one. This one as you can see is much more contracted and I'm going to be very careful cutting this since this is going to be super tight. Uh, and here is the entry point with my special glasses. I'm able to see quite a lot and very carefully. And you can actually hear it, the implant being cut. And as I twist and turn this, you can see The implant, this is the other side of it. it You can actually hear that plastic piece and I'm gonna rip this open and you can see how it was bunched together. Again, very similar to this one as I let go and this is how it was unraveled on itself and you can see i'm going to open it up you can see the indentation on it much more prominent and even as i try to fix it it has assumed this position uh, and i can see right here this is the mentor 375 cc's on the left and the contracture had essentially made it into a ball so okay over here no rupture everything preserved done end block uh, 325 on this side um, and uh, 375 on that side and you can see the size difference as well. Uh, hopefully you found this informative. Again, look at the consistency of this capsule that no matter how hard I have tried, I cannot tear this. This needs to come out and this is certainly the standard of care. Please ask me any questions. Uh, we'll have a Facebook live session um, very soon um, and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you may have. Thank you again very much Dr. Khan from Khan Plastic Surgery Academy and from executiveplasticsurgery.com. Thanks. Bye-bye.